welcome back to my channel my name is Laura and today I'm doing an unboxing of my diamond painting I uh, sent them a picture of my triplets and today uh, it took over a month for them to send me uh, the canvas along with all the diamonds beads so I'm gonna unbox it and I already took it out and I have it on the counter so I'm gonna share with you what it looks like on the counter I already rolled out the canvas. This is um, the canvas that I got. And um, underneath is my uh, triplets. And the picture will look like this. This is their bar mitzvah picture that I sent them. So this is the bar mitzvah picture. Um, it's going to be in blues and golds. And look at all the beads that I got for this project. Oh my god, it's going to take me months to do this. But, yeah. So, that's the beads. I'm going to unbox this. It's hard because I'm holding the camera. It comes with all the supplies. You get this. Um, the bead holder and the glue and, the, and a tweezer and the little um, tray holder. And you get all the beads for the project. And the only thing is, like, the last one that I did had a clear covering. This one, I don't see the design, so. Okay, now I'm going to try to uh, open this up a little bit because I'm so excited because I can't wait to see what it really looks like. So, can you see that? Look at the colors. This is a 40 by 50. I sent them my picture. Um, look at that, how pretty. Oh, here's my kids here. You can see my kids here. I can't wait to see what it's going to look like when I fill it in. This is uh, Victoria, this is Justin, and there's Naomi. And they're in front of a Torah on their bar mitzvah. So, yeah. So, very pretty. I can't wait to work it, but you can see that it is everything is a bead so this is going to take a very long time to uh complete so yeah but so cool anyway let's see the colors of the beads so this is what the project's going to look like they gave me little bags there's little baggies here so those are empty That's what the project's going to look like when it's complete. And let's see all the beads. This is a nice purple and a blue, green. And they all have numbers on them, so it tells me what number to use, which is pretty cool. Here's another blue, different shades of blue. Look at all this gold. A lot of gold. Gold and browns. I'm probably going to put them in number order so it's easier to find. Oh, look over another blue. Yeah, it's all gold and blue. Gold, is this in the camera? Well, that's a lot of beads. I hope I have a nice audio book to listen to while I do this project. <laughs> it's going to take me months. <laughs> so... What I could do is like, as I do like a whole section, maybe I could do an update and show you what it looks like. Cause this is not going to take a two day project. This is going to be a lot more than two days. <laughs> My other project, which I just did the butterfly was only two days. So yeah, that's some orange there and yellow. Whoa, look at all those colors. And lots of black. Here's my black. This is black. 
this is going to be fun putting these in order. I got some, there's some extra ones in there, but I'm sure I probably, in the bag, there's some extra blue, but I think I probably, they give you enough that you have extra, so I'm sure I probably don't need those. So anyway, so anyway, this is my new project that I'm going to be working on uh, as I listen to my audiobooks. So this is going to take a long time. I'm going to tape this to my table and uh, maybe I'll do like at the end of the month, like an update and see how far I got. Uh, my daughter, I gave her her project. Oh, well, let me show you what she made. I gave her her project and she complained the whole entire time. I'm going to take the plastic off. This is her project. The only thing that she b did beads on was the Eiffel Tower. And she was saying to me, Mom, this is tedious. Mom, this takes too long. You know, so I, I, I don't think she would ever do a big project like I'm going to do. Uh, yeah, so this is her project. And this is the one that I did. I have it stored over here. It's going to take the plastic off. See, the, the way I did mine was I had this light sheet of plastic on top. Uh, from a different company. I only did the butterfly. So this is the little plastic that was on top. Uh, I could see the project even with the plastic on top. So as I was working, I would pull it up. So this other project is going to be very strange for me because I can't see my um, design. Uh, but I know it's going to be my triplets when I'm finished. So it should be really fun. But uh, yeah, this didn't, t this one took me two days to do. So I, this, my major project's going to take a long time. So just to let you know. Uh, so getting all my beads together, I have these little, little, little Ziploc bags and I put the number on them, uh, for each color. Um, and then what I do is I snip it. I snip the little bag. I tried to make, th they come in like these really long things. So it's very hard to get it into the little bag. So I cut it down to like three. Um, and here's three. And then I'll snip it off and then I'll pour it into the little bag. So you have this little bag and this is color number 436. And then I put them in number order in this little tiny bin. Here's my little bin from Target. And I have them all in here with the number coded in, in uh, number order. And then I have my supplies. These are extra. These are, I had a lot of black. So I didn't cut all these up. So I put the, this is 310, which is black. And I stuck it in the big Ziploc. And then I also have my supplies here in the side of the bag. So it fits really nicely in here. So that's what I'm doing. It takes about... Oh, it took me last night an hour, and then I still have these more to do. So I have a little more to do, and then I'm gonna then I'll be done. They'll be all sorted, ready to go, and then I can start my project. So yeah, a lot of work, but it's gonna look really nice when I'm finished. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in another video. Bye.